What's up, everybody? Carbo Moser, which welcome. Time to do another break. We're going to be doing 2018 score football half case number number two. All right. So here's the case. Now, these are 10 packs per box. So it's not that bad. But the packs are hella fat. Which I don't mind. What's up, Michelle? Michelle wants that Jimmy G. You got it. Your wish is my command. Yeah, Richard. Yeah, they are. Super duper thick. Alright, here we go. I already see Panini points in there. Which I am not a fan of. Try to keep each uh, stack separated. Each stack would be a, a box. That's a box right there, that stack. I believe it's, uh, I think it's three or four autos per box in score football. Badouche. 
Mm, what up, JL Chin? Uh, do I have any baseball personals? I do. It's called 20, I think it's, what is it, 2018 All-American Perfect Game uh, All-American Autographs. Uh, it's eight autographs per box. It is the top prospects uh, in baseball. Check it out. It's on our website. the uh, box is open. Two more packs to open here.
All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Let's see what we got. To 35, Marlon Mack, Colts. The only autographs in this set are the rookies. Jarvis Landry at 20 for the Dolphins. I'm going to miss this guy, bro. Such a beast. Browns are going to have a really nice team, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, the Browns. I, think I thought I said it the Bills. All right. That's one uh, low stack. I think this is an auto right here. Royce Freeman, the autograph out of Oregon. I appreciate you, Richard. I appreciate you. But yeah, it's getting hella quiet. I mean, it's, it is. It's only three in the morning over here on the East Coast, uh, and a good portion of our of our peeps are on the west uh, on the west on the West Coast. So that would explain them uh, logging off. So, Richard, man, you got to teach me the ways, bro. How can I become a house husband? That's like my that's like my dream job right there. What's up, Bergie? Bergie, it's a little late for you, old man. What you doing up this, this late? No, you're probably going to work if I know you. Vita Vea with the autograph. There you go. You're listening to me break while you watch homeless people in Everett, Washington? What? You just got home from work, Bergie? Damn, dog. Damn, Bergster. Putting in that overtime, I see. How you been, man? Did you watch the NFL draft? What are your thoughts? Um, I saw that earlier, my friend, and I, I asked if you were streaming for us. Um, I saw a spot that I found on the stream. Do you need that to be going for right now? If so, I will stop what I'm doing with three questions. I did see your whisper and regards to the stream. There's a Jimmy G. So if I'm going to do that now, but I can do that now. No ink on it. The Browns were stupid. With which pick? Because I'm, I'm going to kind of agree. I thought they should have picked up a running back. They should have picked up Saquon with their first pick. And with the fourth pick, they should have got like Bradley Chubb or a Roquan Smith or something like that, man, to help their defense. You know, Denzel Ward is probably the best corner, but... One corner ain't gonna help out that that whole D. Well, Richard must be nice. Deshaun Hand, the autograph there. An Alabama boy. How did your team do, Bergie? What are you, a Vikings fan? Damn, the wife is 15 younger than you. Damn, dog. So there's hope for me yet. My wife may not have even, may not have even been born yet. <laughs> that's creepy. Oh, that's that's right, creepy. 
I thought the Dolphins had a pretty good draft. I mean, disappointed we didn't draft a quarterback. Not uh, not like I was expecting us to, anyway. I think if Josh Allen was still there at 11, we probably would have drafted him. But I like, I like what we did in the draft. We addressed uh, all our main concerns. Now it's time to go to work. Hopefully Tannehill can stay healthy for this year. Um, and he can be our quarterback. He's either going to be our quarterback moving forward or he's not. Like I feel like this is a make or break season for Tannehill. Score football. Number to 50, Cliff Averill, the relic. I'm sorry, the parallel. Steelers had a great draft quarterback and a wide receiver from the same school. See, at least they're preparing for the eventual departure of Roethlisberger. I'm surprised the Patriots didn't draft a quarterback either. They got a good running back, though, uh, Nick Chubb, I believe. It's either Nick Chubb or um, Sonny Mitchell went to the, to, to the Patriots. As you can see, Panini points, we need to random. We'll do that at the end of the break. Not a fan of Panini points, man. Panini points replace uh, an autograph, which absolutely sucks. Instead of getting an autograph, we get some Panini points. And that's no fun. Shaquem Griffin, I think, got drafted by the Seahawks, which is pretty awesome because his brother also plays there, Shaquille Griffin. I'm going to try to at least straighten these out a little. So, Bergie, how the hell you been, man? You don't come in here that often anymore. When I first started breaking, you were here every single night. What happened? Was it something I said? Ronnie Harrison to 20. Parallel out of uh, Alabama. Alabama, man. He's strong, he fast, he's active. Alabama, man. Shut up, bitch, and make me a sandwich. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, South Park. Ah, touche, Bergy, touche. See, we're both moving on to bigger and better things, man. That's what's up. You still doing the old, uh, what is it? I think you were like a, like a, like a truck driver or something like that? Uh, driving rigs and shit? All right, that's one box down. Word. Any any stories that you'd like to share, uh, Bergie?
Tyler Lockett to 50 for the Seahawks. Dang, it's already May. Wow. It's gonna be May. You worked 74 hours last week? That's a lot of hours. How many days are you working, Berkey? That's crazy, dude. That's like 12 hour work days, six days a week or something, man. What the hell? <sighs> Gotta make that money, man. I thought I was working hard. I guess I could work a little bit harder. Thanks for the motivation, Bergy. If your old ass can do it, then I fucking gotta do it. I'm just gonna flip everything right side up now. There it is, all right. Some noise next year. Sign in Chucky, Coach. Uh, Coach. I always forget his last name. His first name for that matter too. What can I think of his name? I know his name too. But um, whatever. Batman, Batman. Do you see the autograph? Look, like I'm back there. We will be. Uh, no, that's not the one. And where is it? I thought I seen it. Oh, there it is. Auto for Chase Edmonds. Rather, rather. are starting to wear off boy there's an auto and it's a good one for mr. Bradley Chubb it's a good card I think he got drafted by the Broncos with the number I think it was the number four or five pick
Wait, could have sworn. Oh, I did. I thought I was tripping. I was like, I thought that card was autographed. Sorry to lose my mind. Yeah, the Bradley Chubb, most definitely a nice card. I mean, I'm dying here, y'all. About to fall asleep. Dalton Schultz to 20, trying to wake me up there. Out of Stanford. Get this out the way here. What up, Bergie? What's up, Bergie? Have I pulled any monsters from Bowman yet? Uh, I did pull... What's it called? Hey, I ain't like Brisson, Bergie. I'm running on about four hours of sleep here the last 48 hours, so appreciate you. Uh, anyways. Well, here's an auto. For Steve Ishmael. Boom. A handful of Altoids and a cold mineral water wake me right up. Why does that sound like... I don't know, that sounds like... Problems. I don't know if you heard that, but that's also my stomach telling me, Hey, not only are you tired, but you're also hungry. <laughs> awesome, lovely, great. Anyway, Bergy, uh, I had the, the sickest card I've pulled out of Bowman is probably a Hunter... It's a Hunter Green... Brendan McKay dual autograph. There's an auto on one side and an auto on the back. Uh, number to 25. Pretty sick card. That's probably the nicest card I've pulled out of that. I have yet to pull a, a single Otani autograph, um, which is no bueno. All right, I think I, I think I got my second win here. Let's see how long that lasts. <laughs> Yeah, people in the chat were going pretty nuts. Otani is freaking insane hard to hit. And people know it. The 20, Jaleel Scott. Um, nah, dude, I'm not going to hit no Taco Bell for breakfast. Heck no. Uh, I think I have food at home. And not just that, but there's like a little, there's a bakery here. Uh, on the way home, I could stop by. It's a 24-hour bakery. You know, they make sandwiches, all types of stuff. And it's pretty cheap, you know, compared to, like, fast food. It's about the same. You know, what I would spend at Taco Bell or whatever, I could just go to, the, to Pinecrest Bakery and spend a little bit less and actually get more food. So I might do that, but actually I need to I need to take a friend to the airport at about 4.30, which is an hour from now, more or less. And as you can see, I think I fell asleep, I think I fell asleep just now. <laughs> Probably for like a couple minutes, maybe. How long did I doze off for? Damn, Bergie. Must be nice. So for the Giants, you're looking for Heliot Ramos. And the A's, who are you looking for in there? 
Or maybe you're not looking for Heli Al Ramos in the Giants. You're probably looking for somebody else. I don't know. To 50 Golden Tate for the Lions. Oh, dude, way better. It's it's actual food instead of, you know, like preservatives. So, yes, way better. Way, way better. Oh, Lord. How am I going to make it through this break? Subway should enter the 24-7 game. 24, dude, Subway, a 24-7 Subway would be pretty badass. Austin Allen, autograph right there. Don't know if he got drafted or not, but there you go. So, Bergie, how long was I out for? You were out for like 10 minutes, motherfucker. <laughs> That's not cool. Only at truck stops, they have subway that are 24-7? Yeah, <laughs> that sounds about right, Bergie. I was wondering, man, because in my head it's really quick. But in real time, it could be, you know, like five minutes, ten minutes, or something like that. No, no, dude, I, I seriously, like, trust me, I, I, I closed my eyes. I thought I was blinking. <laughs> and then I wake up and I just, I see my boy uh, over on Breakers, like, yo, wake up, bro. But I, got, I, can, I can feel. My eyes getting heavy. And I gotta take this motherfucker to the fucking airport. Why why did I have to why did I have to be such a good friend? Seriously. I should have just told him to go fuck himself. But not legit. I close my eyes, I'm like, I'm I'm just gonna rest my eyes for a little bit. Just gonna rest my eyes for a little bit. And I was probably gone for like <laughs> I wonder how long I was gone. It's probably gone for like two, three minutes, maybe five or something. That's embarrassing. Oh God. Whatever though. Uh, to fifty, Lashawn McCoy Bills. I think I caught my second wind just now. I think I caught my second wind. We got Ronnie Harrison, autographed six out of six. That's pretty nice. Was I snoring? I'm not sure. I probably was. I probably was. But Bergie, Bergie's known me long enough to know when I'm, like, knocked out. He was with me uh, during my early days as a breaker. Where I would sometimes literally just fall asleep during, during a live stream or during a break or something. Autograph for Duke Dawson. Boom. Don't edit. I mean, it's, why would if I edit it? That'd be pretty. That'd be pretty stupid. And it would look super shady. Plus, it's you know. A lot funnier when you get to see me like snore or something. And then I wake myself up because I snore so loud. And plus, I kind of want to see it for myself too. <laughs> Later on, when I'm smoking a blunt. Yeah, 
watch the break and be like, hmm, at the five minute mark, you can clearly hear fucking bears mating. Oh no, that's just me snoring. You fell asleep at work one time? Dude, I fell, uh, dude, I, fa uh, bro, what? I've fallen asleep at every job I've ever had. I <laughs> uh, don't know if I should be admitting that, but yeah, I have. Rashad, I'm sorry, Rashad Jones. Cameron Wake to 20 for the Dolphins. And I still have another break to go. Luckily, that break is pretty quick. So I'm kind of, kind of, kind of getting my second, my second win here. Where, listen, as much as I like to think of myself as a, as a god, I am most definitely a human. So yeah, you know, I, I am susceptible to sleep and and, and whatnot. One time for 45 minutes, you woke up, all the phones ringing, everybody screaming, what's going on? <laughs> well, what do you do, Gil? I hope you're not like a fucking dispatcher or something with lives on the line. When somebody calls you 911, please help me. Okay, let me just, let me just rest my eyes real quick. What happened? The building's on fire. A train operator? Edgar, you're a train operator? Gil, a remote surgeon? What? The fuck is that? Nick Chubb with the auto. That's a good card. Uh, a remote surgeon. When I think of a remote surgeon, I think of a, you know, I, I just take it literally. So you're a surgeon, but you only do remote surgeries. So, like, you fix, like, remote controls. Or maybe you, you do it from a remote isolated location via robots in the Internet. And you're like, I don't know. I'm, I'm so, you know, you know, you know, when you're so tired, you start to get delirious and you, you could like hallucinate a little bit, kind of, that's kind of where I'm at right now. Not quite, but getting there. Dude, I'm gonna get home and I'm gonna fucking knock out, which at this rate, I'm probably not gonna get home until six o'clock. I gotta take this dumbass to the airport, and by the time I get back home, it'll probably be like six or seven in the morning. Hopefully, there's oh god traffic. Ugh. All right, let's 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 do this shit here. Let's do this shit. Just trying to put this thing into overdrive a little bit here. Or you know what, Jesse? No, no, you shouldn't. Just relax. It's not that serious. You got plenty of time. Uh, dude, if I drink another monster, my fucking heart is going to explode out of my my chest. All right. Sam Hubbard to 35. I really I really need to lay off the monsters, though. That shit is not good for you at all. Anything that accelerates your heart rate is probably not good for you. Make sure everything's facing one direction. All right. Number to 50. Eric Reed, Niners. Uh, tomorrow I am on. Dude, I'm on until Saturday. I am on until Saturday. Jason will be live Sunday and then Monday. What do you got going on, Edgar? I think I know where the auto is. To the back or right here. Carry on Johnson with the autograph. 
It's a nice card. I'm trying to rest my eyes again. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Or maybe I'm not. Uh. And here, thought you wouldn't notice me taking like a quick pause in between stacks. Like, <laughs> let me just rest my eyes right quick. I mean, just, just for like five minutes. You're on your second pot of Java waiting for the last eBay break? Oh, man. Maybe that's what I need. Some coffee. Well, not, not anymore. Not at this hour. John Kelly, the autograph out of Tennis Street. All right, Devin. Have a good night, dude. A little jujitsu. Look at this dude out here kicking names and taking ass. <laughs> Sounds good, Bergy. Nice to see you and hear from you again, man. Hope all is well. Keep keeping on, my guy. Stay beautiful. I'm just going to flip everything right side up here. Because that is one of my fucking pet peeves. And I think you guys will appreciate seeing everything in one direction. At least I know I would. So what do you well so are are you like an MMA fighter or something, Edgar? Or you just do jujitsu just for like shits and gigs? I would like to learn a martial art. That's pretty badass. Jake Weineke with the auto. Top of that. Number 250, Cooper Cup, Rams. So Fitty, Naheem Hines. Oh wow, Edgar. You got a bit of a smart ass on your hands there. <laughs> like father like son, huh? That sounds like something you would do too. When you were a kid. Fitty Carson Palmer Cardinals. Uh, <coughs> yeah, 
seriously got to speed things up. <laughs> so Edgar, what did what did you learn from your from your little lesson there? Don't fuck with Sensei. Martial arts are no joke, man. The, that's the arts of kicking ass. You know so. Regardless of what they tell you, oh, it's for you know it's for protecting yourself. Yeah, protecting yourself from an ass whooping. And what's the best way to protect yourself from an ass whooping? You dish out the ass whippings. You know, I I, I um I seen a, I seen a quote on uh, on the internet or something, uh, and it goes. So I don't know if it's like an ancient Asian proverb or something, but it goes, "It's better to be a warrior in a garden in a garden than a gardener in times of war." You know what I'm saying? And I thought about it. I was like, "Damn, that's some hard ass shit." Right? Is though with the auto, you can do it all night long. Six minute rounds, two minutes, you were gas, had to spar three man. Almost done. Still got two boxes left to go through. Each stack is a box. Number to thirty five, Keenan Allen, Chargers. I think at this point I'm just gonna stop flipping them right side up. This is pain in the ass. I'm sorry. I am so sorry, y'all. Got Magenta play for Desmond King of the Chargers. It's pretty nice. Little one on one mojo. Not autographed though, unfortunately. There you go, Edgar. Same here, man. Wish I started that thing when I was a jit. Actually, I went through this already. Thirty-five Marlon Mack, Colts. Watch out, Edgar! Before you know it, your kid's gonna be whooping your ass. That's gonna upset the balance. Next thing you know, he's gonna put a little bit more bass in his voice, stick his chest out.
Mike White autograph Robert. Richard, I appreciate you still hanging out with me, man. Because if the chat was dead right now, I'd probably still be asleep. Which would actually make for some pretty funny moments. <laughs> Brett Kiesel. To 25 for the Steelers. A rare veteran autograph in score football. Don't see too many uh, veteran autos. Let them know who the boss is, baby. That's right, Edgar. That's right. Establish dominance. Raiders to 20, Mario Edwards Jr. Oh man, if I fall off the chair, that'd be even funnier. What are you talking about? I was hoping that like my head would hit the camera <laughs> and wake me up. <laughs> that'd be great. Lavon Coleman, autograph out of Washington. Dude, I'm going to sleep so good today. You don't even know. And you know what's the worst part, though? Is, like, I know it's going to happen. Like, I'll be done. Yeah, no, there's, there's a partner of mine. He's uh, He does Pokemon breaks, so I'm not here by myself. But, um... What you call it? Yeah, I'm, I do have company, so there's at least that. Me and, and the Cardboard Casper, too. Uh, our friendly neighborhood ghost that we have in his office. To 50, Reggie Raglan, Chiefs. But what I was going to say was, it's, I don't know, maybe this happens to you guys or not. But, like, I'll be doing something. Like, let's say, you know, I'll be at work or something, right? And I'm fucking tired, falling asleep. But as soon as I get off the clock, oh, that's when I get a fucking surge of energy out of nowhere. Like, damn, where the fuck was this energy when I needed it? You know, I get home and I'm fucking doing cartwheels and all this other shit. I can't go to sleep. And then when I go to sleep, an hour later, my alarm rings. Hey, it's time to go to work, bro. Ray Ray McLeod, the autograph rocker. Last stack mojo, which means last box mojo. Arden Key autographed the 20. That's a good card. That's a good card. What else we got? Sonny Mitchell, 20 out of 20 right there. Bear Nash. Well, no, my, my partner, my boy, my boy Mario, he only does Pokemon. 
Uh, but I hear him thinking about doing like Yu-Gi-Oh and maybe Magic at some point. But right now, all he does is Pokemon. Uh, and us here at Rip City Cards, we only do sports. Uh, and sometimes we'll do like non-sports stuff like wrestling or maybe some Walking Dead or Marvel Gems. But it's very rare. It's very rare. You know, sometimes we'll get product where it's like celebrities in it. Or, you know what I mean? <coughs> right. It, exactly. Like, he still works with it. Like, he works under the Ripping Wax umbrella. But he's he's his own entity, you know? But we are with the same company. Uh, Ryan Izzo, the autograph. I'll be honest, I don't know where, where a good portion of these players are actually actually got drafted to, so apologize ahead of time, uh, especially during the recap when I'm just going to say their names and be like, uh, I don't know who you play, bro. Uh, to 50, we have Graham Gano Panthers. Heck yeah, they still sell Marvel cards. And it's not cheap either. <coughs> Some of those cards where, like, the artist hand draws them, and they're, like, one-on-ones. Dude, those cards go for some, some moolah. To 20, we have Dante Pettis. I mean, you could look it up, Edgar. Go to go to eBay and type in Marvel Gems, and look at the sold listings. And some of that stuff is like stupid money. Hundreds of dollars for a sketch card of like fucking Wolverine or something. Demarco Murray to fifty for the Titans. I uh, no, I did not, Edgar. Drop a link, dog. we got almost done to 20 Jake Elliott kicker for the Eagles you don't see too many kickers that's nice all right this thing is just dumb put that link up Edgar don't threaten me with a good time To Fiddy, James Washington. <clears throat> Last stack, Mojo. We got Josh Adams. The autograph. Boom. What else we got? Boom. We're done. Hallelujah. All right. 
Uh, before I actually do the recap of the autographs here, peeps, uh, I do have one little thing I need to random. And that's 150 million points. So to do that, I'm going to roll die, see how many times I'm going to go on the randomizer. I'm going to go 11 times in the randomizer. Uh, and the top team will be receiving the 150 uh, Panini points. Now I need to copy and paste the teams. Do the old copy and paste action. There we go. All teams there. Going 11 times. Top team in the randomizer. Uh, at the top of the list, after 11 times, we'll win 150 penny points. Good luck. And the money shot 11. Boom, 11 times. The Browns receiving 150 Panini points. And so it shall be. All right, now it's time for a recap. Uh, so we did get a 101 printing plate for Desmond King of the Chargers. And our autographs were Josh Adams, uh, Ryan Izzo, Sonny Mitchell, Arden Key, Ray Ray McLeod, LaVon Coleman, the rare veteran, Brett Kiesel, Steelers, Mike White, Ryan Izzo, Jake, uh, Jake Wienicke, John Kelly, Kerryon Johnson, Nick Chubb, Duke Dawson, Ronnie Harrison, Austin Allen, Steve Ishmael, uh, Dalton Schultz, Bradley Chubb, Chase Edmonds, Deshaun Hand, Vita Vea, and Royce Freeman. Not a bad uh, half caser there. And that was the break, you guys. 2018 score football half case number two, eBay style. Thank you very much.